happy Monday. I don't really have anything to talk about that I can think of offhand. Nothing. It's burning. A burning desire to speak about. Um, which then sends my mind into the into the you know why are you doing these things every day? And my the other side of me says because you've committed to doing them. And, and to nobody except yourself. And they do, uh, these, they ground me, you know, and some, to some extent, they ground me. And they, um, they do force me into a state of a bit of gratitude to get present in this particular moment talking to whomever, maybe nobody, maybe the one person out there, or maybe two. Uh, and this, I do these after, generally I meditate, so I get, it's another way of getting present. Uh, sometimes I exercise beforehand as well. And that's all part of my morning routine, to get aligned and bring my, my best part of myself to the day. Because otherwise, I'm the kind of person that feels, if I begin to feel rushed or behind, I, I get anxious and, ah, you know, I'm already late. I'm from the East Coast, so uh, early is on time, you know. On time is, what is it? Early is on time. On time. As late. And late is unacceptable. <laughs> I don't know why I thought. Yes, early is on time, and uh, on time is late, and late is unacceptable. Uh, I'm very circled around the uh, issue of time when I was growing up, uh, and uh, yeah, the importance of being on time and respect, which I think is completely valid, and yeah, I think uh, I would certainly rather be early than late. I hate it. So bringing that same attitude towards the day, I don't want to be, I'd rather be early for everything. I'd rather get up early, um, not miss the day. And that wasn't always like that. I used to sleep in to, till, you know, when I was late night type guy. Um, yeah, so why am I doing these? I don't know. Just as much for myself as for anybody else, I guess. It helps. I don't know. To some degree, it helps differentiate the voices that I have, the committee that I have in my head to give more credence to the one that's speaking to you and to align that voice with the true, like my, what I believe to be my true voice, I guess, like my heart versus the fear and, and hesitation and anxiety which burrows in my brain and in my ego uh, that wants to be more than I am or fears that I'm not enough for you, for everyone, for myself, I'm gonna fail the what if, the projection into the future, the regret of the past, all of that. So it helps me get back to here, now. Oh yeah, right here, right now. Monday morning. Gratitude. Somewhat healthy body. Somewhat sane mind. Pretty good. Much love.